Hi, uh, Suraj here again from Stockton, Hong Kong. Uh, second cocktail that we'll be making is our signature. It's uh, uh, infamously called the Big Dick. Uh, this drink, uh, let me explain that the name is an odd to the conversation that uh, F. Scott Fitzgerald and Hemingway had. Now, in here in Stockton, all our drinks are named are inspired after authors and writers that were famous for drinking and for their writing as well. So this story goes, uh, and this anecdote kind of goes when uh, F. Scott Fitzgerald's wife approaches him and, and says that he's only been with one gentleman, that's him, and she thinks his dick is too small. So he goes up to Hemingway and says, now they, they were buddies back then, and he goes up to Hemingway and says, would you have a glance at my penis and, and tell me if it's big or not because my wife is complaining. So Hemingway being a gentleman said yes and they went to the saloon uh, at the bathroom and uh, F. Scott, F. Uh, Scott Fitzgerald, he opened his pants and he looked at the dick and said, no bro, you've got a, you've got a big dick. And just to, uh, to, to make him feel comfortable, he did explain that all the Greek gods and goddesses, all, all the male figures like gods, uh, all his statue had small penis. Now the reason it was so is because having a small anat anatomical part of a, of a male meant you were more richer and more educated. So it was, it was uh, Hemingway again becoming very clever right away and trying to sue his friend uh, F. It's called uh, Gerald. Yeah. So that's why the, the, the name of the drink, Big Dick. Right. We're going to make that right now. So I'm going to use 22 mils of uh, fresh lime. Three dash of chocolate bitters. Three dash of mace, 22 mils of uh, baked cane syrup, uh, banana, malted banana. So we take banana, cane, and bake that in an oven, take it out, strain it, add some malt powder, and then just blend it and strain that off. A little bit of cane because the drink is, the base of the drink is rum. So we still want to s still be in the same, same path. And for the main spirit, we'll be using our rum blend. It's infamously called the Dig Blend. So it has three different kinds of uh, uh, English style rum. So we have uh, Diplomatico, Exclusive, some Myers, and I Blackwell. And it's mixed with some Irish whiskey just to give it a little bit of character and some PX Sherry as well. So we do uh, 45 mils of the total blend. Then For the garnish, we take the whole box of ice, tip that in uh, cocoa butter, just as so, and uh, because the cocoa butter is uh, it has higher fat content, so as soon as you introduce the ice, it, it frozes and, and capsules the ice. So it's, it's there for the the aesthetic purpose, plus the, the butter acts like a, a natural uh, lip balm. When you drink and touch your lips, it's kind of gonna have that glossy look. It's always a very nice 
icebreaker when you're here 2 a.m. in the morning having a big day. Yeah, Jack, Jack, enjoy. Let us. 